so guys we're gonna be starting out with the face okay so this is how your girl's face looks like i think it will be fair enough if we are talking about how to get an even skin tone i think it will be fair for me to show you guys how my skin actually looks up close okay so this is my face without any skincare products i just come out of the shower like there is no makeup on my face like this is just my natural and bare face And my face actually wasn't really like this in 2020. Like, I used to have, like, pigmentation on my face. And I was a lot darker in 2020 because I wasn't taking my skincare seriously. When I started taking care of my skin in 2020, up until now, I am still taking care of my skin. And that is why I look like this. So if you want to have an even skin tone, you have to make sure, first of all, you have to make sure that you have what you are using to cleanse your face, okay? For me, I personally use, I use this CeraVe sometimes CeraVe hydrating um cleanser like since i started using it i don't really like it like let me just be honest like i don't really like it i don't know like i'm not just a cleanser girl i think i'm more of like a bath soup girl like i really really love bath soaps so i mostly use bath soap on my face i got this um true promotion but ordinarily i wouldn't have bought CeraVe like that's just me being honest okay so um normally i use bath soaps on my face i prefer to use bath soap some people will tell you don't use bath soaps on your face bath soap is no good blah 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 but i'm a kind of person that i listen to my skin okay what do i like what works for me that is what i'm going to do if bath soap works for my face that is what i'm going to use i'm not going to follow skincare trends because people are using cleansers i'll not go and use cleanser i will use what is working for me okay so guys this is the soap i got this soap um i think on sunday and i've been using it for like four days okay and i really like this one this one is a turmeric with honey soap for soft for smooth soft and radiant skin so this is what i currently like use on my face i've been using it for just four days so i can't really tell if it's actually like doing anything on my face because as of on sunday this is how like this was how i actually looked and this soap contains turmeric and honey and that is why i got it because i am a lover of like face masks i do turmeric milk and honey face masks so i just thought like get this soap i also use the ashanti papaya soap i've talked about that on my channel before if you want to have an even skin tone on your face you have to make sure you find what works for you find what you are going to use to cleanse your face whether it's a um liquid cleanser or whether it's a bar soap whichever one works for you make sure you buy the one that works for you to so cleanse your skin get rid of the surface dirt on your face because without getting rid of the surface dirt on your face like you're not going to have that even skin tone so find the perfect cleanser for you next thing we're going to talk about right now is exfoliation and the approach you use in exfoliating your skin you know plays a lot in getting an even skin tone for me i love to use chemical exfoliants because that works for me perfectly i use this one this is a clean and clear blackhead clearing cleanser this is an exfoliator and it is also like my toner okay so this is what i use to exfoliate my face i actually just got this one and it cost me 3200 naira i've been using it for like two years now and anytime i use my toner like I just feel good like guys um i currently use this toner every single day because like before it was a little bit too sensitive for me i think that was like 2022 it was like sensitive on my skin but right now like i use it every day and i don't have any issues at all so you want to make sure you are getting an exfoliator to exfoliate your face that way you are always going to have like you know bright skin okay i won't consider my skin type fair i'll consider myself caramel but as you guys can see my face this is my face up close i'm sorry that i'm too close to the screen but <laughs> i have been exfoliating since 2020 and my skin really loves this exfoliator slash toner because this is also my toner okay i sometimes use other toners but you know i'm not going to talk about those other toners because we're talking about how to get an even skin tone so um i'm just going to stick to talk um to talking about an exfoliator this is an exfoliator that would exfoliate your face and make your face brighter and you're going to have an even skin tone and what salicylic acid does is that it goes into your pores and clean your pores like it get rid of all the dead that's clogging your pores and you know prevent acne prevent 
um you know bumps on your face since i started using this toner i can't count how many times i actually have acne like i barely have acne on my face so this works perfectly for me so always make sure you find find an exfoliator that works well for you you can try this one that i showed you guys this um clean and clear it's very good and the third thing i'll talk about in actually um having a an even skin tone is by using serums okay or using actives like um these are the serums that i use on my face i use this balance active okay i use this balance active this is the balance active vitamin c brightening serum and this helps to brighten your face and to give you more even looking complexion and also make you glow like also make your skin glow and this is the niacinamide one and this one helps to um improve your skin texture and it targets you know um acne prone skin or blemish prone skin okay so these are the serums that i use on my face um i don't it's not like i just started using balance axis before i used to use um advanced clinical vitamin c serum but i recently started using these two and my skin loves it okay so if you want to have an even skin tone on your face maybe you have like dark spots on your face i would advise that you try you can also try um doing home um home remedies you can do like um facial marks because i do a lot of facial marks i do turmeric i do honey i do milk i do that like sometimes every saturday and like i don't have any dark spots on my face so you can try to do home remedies if home rem remedies are not working for you because i know some people actually have sensitive skin and putting turmeric or honey or milk on your face can actually aggravate your pimples or even make your dark spots go worse if you're not the type that likes to use um home remedies on your face then you can just get you know a serum you can actually get a retinol serum a, like a retinoid or you can use niacinamide or you can also use vitamin c you know just try and get you know any of these products you can try using retinol serum you know and you can try niacinamide you can also try vitamin c it would you know slowly and with time you're going to see difference because you getting rid of your dark spots is not just going to happen one day two days three days it may actually take three months or four months before i got my skin looking like this like without any dark spots i knew what i had to go through i had to be consistent with my skincare consistent with my home remedies because home remedies worked for me i just had to be consistent with everything I, that i was doing okay so another thing that you can do is using serums or using actives in your skincare products and another thing that i'll talk about is sunscreen you guys already know the sunscreen that i use always make sure you wear your sunscreen like we already know how important sunscreens are sunscreens actually help you um not to age faster and it actually helps your dark spots to fade faster so always make sure you get sunscreen and another thing that i would advise you guys to do and this one is optional this one is not for everybody to do but you can actually shave your face i made a video i think two weeks ago where i showed you guys how you can shave your face that was my first time of doing it and after i shaved my face oh my god my skin became more radiant so you can actually try to shave your face so you can actually try to shave your face and i used this my eyebrow razor i think i still have the clip of um when i was shaving my face i'm just going to attach the clip to this video so what i actually did was to use um the Tarasha vitamin c gel i put some gel on my face and i actually like shaved my face down um i shaved my face downwards like i pulled my skin like this and then i shaved my face downwards okay so um you can actually shave your face if you shave your face it's going to make your face more radiant and shaving of the face is known as dharma planning and i'm going to put the link to that video in my description box in case you guys are interested in watching the video or i'll just make a separate video on how you can shave your face but shaving of the face is something that i would like always do and maybe next time i'm going to shave my face i'm actually going to make a video about it and i'll do a detailed shaving of the face tutorial so shaving of the face actually you know gets rid of hairs on your face and gets rid of like surface dead like when i shaved my face like a lot of things actually came out of my face and i was really surprised that i had that much 
junk gunk on my face so shaving of the face is actually like a form of exfoliation should i say so um shaving of the face can actually make your face appear brighter but I'll, i just want to advise you if you go ahead to shave your face after this video please do not use um do not exfoliate your face do not use your chemical exfoliant or your physical exfoliant don't exfoliate your face because it can actually irritate your skin after shaving your face wash your face and apply your niacinamide serum or your vitamin c serum and go in with your moisturizer okay so that's another thing that you can do that would actually make your face brighter and um i would also suggest for you to get a brighter face, I will also I will also suggest that you get this clay. So this is the Indian healing clay. This clay helps with pore cleansing. Like I think once in a week or twice in a week, you can actually use this clay, and I feel like it's, it will make your face brighter. I used to use this clay like last year or so but i recently just got it again because i can't even find the one i used to have this has a lot of benefits to the skin and i would really recommend that you guys get it because it is going to go deep into your pores clean your pores remove the dirt remove everything that is not making you glow like yeah it will remove everything and it will really really help your face and if you actually get this you just want to read the instructions at the back you know you mix it with apple cider vinegar or you can mix it with water and apply on your face and you feel like a pulsating you feel your face pulsating okay and then you know when to wash it off i'm actually going to make a video um using this clay um on my face and on my armpits and some parts of my body okay so this is another thing that you can actually use that would really help your face brighten your face because apple cider also has brightening effect and also make sure you make use of good moisturizers i forgot to make mention of moisturizers make sure you use good moisturizers like whichever moisturizer you are using make sure it is one that you know adds hydration to your face because when your face is hydrated you would glow and like you just have this you know glowing even skin tonish kind of thing and also make sure you are using your sunscreen as long as you are using um serums and actives you know spots you know, as long as you are like spots correcting your dark spots then you are going to see changes and your skin will get a lot even okay so yeah i think i've talked about everything on the face and i don't think i made mention of spot correctors you guys make sure you get spot correctors there are different um spot correctors and i'm really happy that i didn't i like i've not used any spot corrector per se because like my home remedies work for me so you can actually get this faded um topicals um spot treatment that spot treatment is actually very good like i know someone that is using it and our spots are faded you can also make use of chestnut chestnut is also a very good option in fading dark spots so guys let's go into body care let's go into body care okay so when it comes to body care in getting an even skin tone we all know that exfoliation is key like when you want to have an even skin tone exfoliation is number one like um oh my god i don't have my exfoliating gloves here ah should i go and get it hmm? you guys know what an exfoliating glove is i'm not going to stand up i'm so tired i don't really think you can actually have an even skin tone without exfoliating okay exfoliation is very very important but first of all we must talk about cleansing just like how we talk about cleansing for the face using cerave or using bath soaps you can also like you know get bath soaps or you can get shower gels you know to cleanse your body because cleansing is also very very important for me i love to use shower gels like when it comes to my body i'm a big fan of shower gel but when it comes to my face i'm a big fan of bath soaps so yeah guys you can just like you know do whatever works for you so i use dove i use dove body wash sometimes i use i use palm olive like i have different body washes that i use and i recently got this ashanti um scrub i have i don't think i've ever i've never used ashanti scrub before on my body i've never exfoliated my skin using ashanti scrub i always used to use kebio and cool spa but i told myself that i'm going to use ashanti so let me buy ashanti so um i actually just got ashanti and um 
this is what i'm going to use to exfoliate my skin I'm, i think i'm going to exfoliate this night like this evening i'm going to exfoliate so this is a scrub that you can actually buy i think this scrub is like 2200 naira, and this scrub contains honey and collagen so i think that's the reason why i even bought it okay um oh it doesn't have the same um fragrance of, as that of Kebu. I think I prefer the fragrance of Kebu. Well, I've already bought this one, so I can't change it. But yeah, guys, the secret to having an even skin tone is exfoliating your body. So you want to make sure you exfoliate your body. There are so many um different exfoliators, like body exfoliators you can use. There is Dr. Teeves, there is Ashanti, there is Kebu. There are so many um, affordable um, exfoliators, like body exfoliators. So just try and get one that, you know, works for you. And um, the next thing after exfoliation is um, using a good body lotion. And um, this is the body lotion that I, this is body lotion that I currently use. I use the Alpha Skin Care Lotion on my body and i've been using it for a long time you guys know that this is what i use and my like it has finished again and i'm in trouble right now because two of my best lotions like they are both finished i have to like place like an order for my body lotions but i tend to use this in the mornings and then i use this at night time this alpha skincare lotion i will give it a 10 over 10. the only thing the only disadvantage with this lotion is that um it is quite expensive and it is not as affordable as other types of lotion or compared to Nivea. i think this Nivea is like six thousand five hundred naira and this one is about fifteen thousand five hundred naira so like there are a lot of difference with um like money difference okay like yeah you guys understand what i'm trying to say so um this alpha lotion like i said i'll give it a 10 over 10. if you have um keratosis pilaris you are suffering from strawberry skin this is the lotion for you because apart from making your skin brighter it is also going to help to smoothen out your skin and if you suffer from body acne like me then this is the lotion for you you guys know that i suffer a lot from body acne like i don't have acne on my face or on my chest but where i have acne is my like my hands okay I always tend to have acne on my hands and as i'm treating it another one is coming out so i honestly do not know what to do about you know my acne i also have like small acne on my back so that is like that is the issue i'm actually facing with my skin right now i don't have any issue with my face or my chest or my legs but i have issue with my and okay and since i started since I using this lotion it has actually been of great help to me because it has you know been brightening my skin before my hands were very dark and ugly but now my hands are becoming brighter and brighter i'm not there fully i'm not where i want to be in my skin or in my dark spots but i think that this lotion has has played a huge role in helping to get rid of my acne because i always break out my hands guys i don't have any acne on my hands right now and helping me to lighten the spots i used to have a lot of spots on my hands guys i'm not going to lie to you i used to have a lot of spots but right now my spots are reducing and i'm really really grateful for that it is not going to work overnight trust me it is not going to like when you start using it after one bottle don't expect that oh all your skin concerns are gone no when it comes to skincare like nothing works immediately you just have to be consistent and i've been using this lotion since i think june or july last year and i really love it i've seen a huge um i've seen huge improvements in my skin some of you guys have actually asked me to make a review of this lotion this lotion is very good this is a this is a cheaper alternative to alpha skincare okay this would actually make your skin brighter this will also make make your skin brighter but this too will make your skin brighter but the only disadvantage with this lotion is that it cannot get rid of your bumpy skin yeah so if you have strawberry legs strawberry skin keratosis pilaris this will not get rid of the bumpiness but if you just want to have an even skin tone then you can use this this will not get rid of your dark spots per se but it will just make your overall body brighter but getting rid of dark spots 
no 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 it's not going to get rid of your dark spots it's just going to make your skin brighter but this will get rid of your dark spots over time and it will brighten your skin and it will also get rid of the bumps and you know keratosis pilaris on your skin so having an even skin tone just has to do with you know being patient and using the right skincare products but, um if you also want to have like even skin tone i feel like you should start incorporating oils into your skincare routine and i really love this one from palmas i think i've used this just three times because um the weather is quite hot right now so i don't want to sweat so that is the reason why i don't use this and this contains vitamin e which would like really help your skin over time to become more glowy and you know just bright and fresh okay so um i think that is all for this video um if you want to have a bright healthy skin just know that you have to be patient with whatever you are doing and you also have to be you know conscious of whatever you put inside your body because if you are always drinking um alcohol you are always smoking you are taking too much of caffeinated drinks or you are taking too much of um of energy drinks then you are going to be dehydrated your skin is going to look dehydrated and if you are taking lots of sugar you are going to get older easily so it will not make you glow so be careful of what you put inside your body okay you can take supplements for me i don't take any supplement supplement right now apart from magic mind that i showed you guys but you can incorporate like evening primus oil to your skincare routine it can also make you brighter and eat you know fruits and vegetables and avoid sugar and alcohol and overly caffeinated drinks or avoid drinking too much coffee because it can actually make your skin dehydrated okay so i think that is all for this video it's been so long since i made a skincare video so i thought to make a skincare video today and i hope you guys did enjoy this video please do well to give the video a huge thumbs up and share this with anybody that you know that might be in need of this information i'll see you guys in my next one until then bye guys